and it came like this so i was really confused <laughs> but i got a package in the mail two days ago me and lee are going on a date night our first actual date since being married so <laughs> at my appointment about my kidneys what i was talking on here about the other day book just had some of my water obviously i have to set the vibe when i'm reading Good morning guys, I am looking extremely puffy faced, I don't know why, I've woke up with like fluid around my left eye which is really quite tender, um, I haven't banged it or got anything in it, I don't know what's up with it but I'm just pulled up to a little side street near the doctors because I've forgotten to bring my, oh, my eyes look really sore, um, I've forgotten to bring my car park change so I've had to find a street to park on so that I don't have to pay for parking. I'm actually just at my appointment about my kidneys, what I was talking on here about the other day. So going to discuss the results from my dip test and take it from there so when i get back at the doctors i will give you a rundown on what it is that they've said i also need to pick india's medication up as well she's run out and they've just got it in the pharmacy for her so i'm gonna go and do that and i'll check back in with you guys in a bit i'm out and um, hold on this light's not very good one's behind me just getting into the car one second Yeah, the doctor said, what's this display on my thing? The doctor said, he's hopeful it's not my kidneys. Um, at this moment, doesn't feel like I need any more tests doing. Uh, however, is a little concerned with the fact that <clears throat> I find relief after I've been to the toilet. So he said he wants me to keep an eye on the progression of that. If I become, if it becomes difficult to pass urine, if I notice anything different in it and all the usual things um, if I start to become numb anywhere to go straight back in but at this moment in time he wants me to go to a physio so um, they're actually providing me with a physio so NHS physio at the doctors and he said it could be weeks and weeks before they have an appointment well into January but I have been given an appointment for next Wednesday so a week today on the 28th so and at my doctor's so I don't have to go far so that's really good news he's going the physio is going to take another look at my back just to see to make sure it definitely isn't a kidney thing make sure it is um more of a muscular thing in my back which we are hoping it is because last thing I need is anything to go wrong with my kidneys last thing anyone needs is anything to go wrong with the kidneys but yeah that's where we uh that's where we start so it's good news for now and even better news that i've been given a physio so i can't complain about that at all especially being seen within a week with it being christmas and everything so i'm very very pleased with that i'm gonna go home now and have something to eat because even though it's now nearly like about time we on? 20 to 11 <clears throat> and i haven't had any breakfast yet and i just did not wake up hungry at all and to be honest i'm not that hungry now but i'm eating but i'm gonna eat because i know i have to eat but yeah i'm just not feeling very hungry today at all so i'm gonna go home make something to eat have a coffee and clean the house the house needs cleaning washing needs doing usual stuff and then i'm gonna read my book for a little bit um my new book which i read a chapter of last night and absolutely loved it didn't want to put it down but we ended up watching arthur christmas which was a really nice christmas family christmas film which i've never watched before but has now since become one of my favorite christmas films i even cried at it but i cry at everything so that's not a surprise me and lee are going on a date night our first actual date since being married so <laughs> this will be nice we're gonna go for something nice to eat in the little village near where we live i would love to have filmed it for you on here and put it on a vlog but obviously my vlogs my vlog will be up before we go out because there's no way I'm going to be able to film, get back and upload a vlog. It won't go until about midnight, it's pointless. <laughs> few hours but i've been cleaning the house is a mess so the bed is currently just with the bottom uh quilted bit on because we've stripped all the bedding and getting all the bedding in the washing machine nice and washed ready clean for christmas but i am gonna go and spend a little bit of time reading my book in a minute now the house is nice and clean and tidy um, i'm gonna do my deep clean on probably christmas eve obviously with indy being a lot older 
Christmas Eve we don't really need to be doing the things we used to do so I've got a couple of hours more spare this year on Christmas Eve than I usually would so I can do my clean then. I'm going to spend an hour or so reading my book and I'm going to do that soon so that I can have a little bit of chill before India goes to her auntie's. Mm. And me and Lee are then going to go on our nice Christmas meal dinner date. So that's going to be a nice evening. But I got a package in the mail two days ago. And if you are new here, hi, welcome by the way. I am an affiliate to a company called Flare Audio and have been for quite some time now. And I won't go too much about what, who Flare Audio are in this video because I have got lots of videos on them and I do talk about them a lot on my Instagram. But Long story short, they help people who have sound disturbance difficulties, so especially if people like me are autistic and sound is one of my triggers for meltdowns and they just produce amazing, amazing, amazing products to help soothe those spiky sounds, I guess you could call them. They do millions of products, headphones, earbuds, earplugs, everything, you name it, they sell it, anything that's to do with sound. So. I won't, like I say, I won't go too much into that because that, that is not what this is about. However, I do always say how incredible they are as a company and as people and they treat their affiliates like family. They are the most beautiful bunch of people running the most incredible business ever. Now, I know you may think, oh, you're going to say that because you're an affiliate to them. I'm an affiliate to other things as well. Flair just treat people they go out the way a lot to make their affiliates feel appreciated for what we do. And so I got a package the other day and I che checked on the shipping because I thought it's not something I've, I've not ordered something. The courier was FedEx and I thought I've never ordered anything that FedEx have brought. And when I looked on the thing where I can track the package, it said Flair Audio. So I was really surprised. I thought, have I ordered something and not realised? But... I got my package, it came in this beautiful little thing and it has a card on. I'll apologise as well if you can hear banging outside and if the dog barks but we have a tip that we're trying to fill up outside and Lee is throwing all the rubbish in it as we speak it's right outside my window so if you can hear any banging that's what that is. But they sent this beautiful Christmas card which I think is so nice of them anyway um, and then a really nice personalised message so it's not like it's just something they're printing out and just sending to all their affiliates, they're taking the time to write personalised messages in it. So they've written, Dear Faye, thank you so much for being such a great supporter of Flare Audio. We've put together a little self-care package to help you keep calm during these busy times. Enjoy. Big love, Team Flare. Is that the most caring group of people you've ever met? So they haven't even sent me like a PR package per se. They've not sent me something to, that they want to be sold or they want advertised. They have literally sent me something because I am autistic and I do struggle, especially around holidays because of the intensity of them. Um, they have sent me a care package and the items inside the care package are not from Flare Audio. Some of them are from like places like Lush and it's like they've got different things from different places and gone out of the way to make a care package. And honestly, I could have cried when I opened it. So thank you so much to you guys at Flare. You have no idea what this means to me. This is what they got. Came with this beautiful little package, all bubble wrapped with a little long live ear sticker. Oh, it's way around today. Might help if you... Oh no, no that's the right way. <laughs> I opened up... I'm trying to see where I can stand you. Let me just... And it came like this, so I was really confused. <laughs> but inside, guys, look. They've literally sent the most beautiful package. Oh, Hotel Chocolat. I've always wanted to eat something from there quite a pricey place I'll have you know um, caramel cheesecake bites guys don't they just look I'm trying to get a better light on them but oh my god yes I'm all about them then we have from Marks and Spencers again not a cheap place and not from Flare Audio it is a calm apothecary a diffuser and it's got inside lavender sweet orange sage and cedar wood it is a seaweed fresh face mask from Lush. Also got honey and aloe vera in as well to protect and soothe skin. Now I wish you could smell this but oh it just smells so clean. And then last but not least a gorgeous candle which has look at this paper I don't even know if it's picking it up but it's like I don't almost like papaya paper papayas am i saying that right papayas paper um and on it it says 100 percent sustainable coconut wax 
sorry if you can hear the outside, 100% essential oils, 100% cotton wick, and it says, I wanted to create candles that nobody else had made, 100% natural, with nothing artificial or man-made, and at the bottom, plant me, I'm filled with wildflower seeds. Is that just the most amazing company, or what? And this is from, they were hand poured in West Sussex in England, so very local, not very local to me but it's in England so I'm absolutely over the moon with that and it's called Made Found Restored is the company and let me tell you now this smells out of this world it smells like the kind of smell you smell when you go into a spa for like a soothing relaxing massage and they have them nice essential oils burning it smells like that so excited to get that lit and have that on I cannot thank Flair Audio enough let me just move this out of the way. I can't even tell you how, how much that makes me, makes me want to cry. I just think it's absolutely beautiful and I'm more, I can't actually put into words how grateful I am for that. So that was a beautiful thing to open up and I just couldn't wait to share that with you guys. But obviously I was crazy busy yesterday with India. So I thought today's a bit of a quieter day for me. So I'm going to show you that today. Yeah. So it is... Just going up for 10 past 3, so I'm going to read until about 22, 4, and then take India. Um, got my book, just had some of my water. Obviously, I have to set the vibe when I'm reading. I want it nice and chilled. did have a Christmas film on, but I've turned it off, so I'm going to pack my little booty on here and have a good read. <laughs> through I've got through another chapter let me just bring you around this way and um, so I'm just gonna pack my butt on here and upload this very vlog and get editing this it may not be up before we go out for our meal tonight because it is about 20 to 4 I need to take Indy to my sisters and then I need to come back and get dressed and our meal is at I'm trying, I'm trying to open this laptop with one hand and our meal is at half past five um, so we probably won't get back to about eight o'clock and I don't really know how it's going to go down and what time this vlog is going to go on, but I'll do my very best to get it on as soon as I can. But for now, I am going to go because I am very, very busy. But I hope you enjoyed this vlog today. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And join me again togmorrow for another day of Vlogmas. Bye.